Karina, there's a lot of talk about mindfulness and meditation. Uh, you've done it all and you still do it all in terms of your daily practice and you teach other people. So how do you understand how to even get started with meditation and mindfulness? Right, because that's the biggest question that there's this all or nothing mentality, which we need to break that stigma because you can meditate for two minutes and it can change your day or you can meditate if you got an hour then you can do it for that long. But it, it's a simple practice. And it's even, I think so many people don't start the mindfulness practice because of just, they think it's too much. They think that's too much that work that has to go into it. And we're afraid of our thoughts, right? And I have a very good mutual friend of ours. And I was like, he was going through a lot of anxiety and struggling with that. And I'm like, why don't you start meditating? And I, ironically, his medical doctors were also saying, you should start meditating. And he's like, but I can't because of the thoughts. The thoughts are okay. Mm -hmm. We have 80 to 100,000 thoughts per day. These are our, This is our brain. And it's fine. Let those thoughts come and let them float away like a cloud. And... Eventually, I always say, uh, you know, coming from a fitness background, our mind is a muscle. So keep strengthening that muscle and you will become stronger and stronger where you can tell those negative thoughts to go away. And I'm not saying any of us are ever perfect in that. Mm -mm. Uh, even myself doing so much work on physical fitness and mental fitness, I still have my days, but I know how to train myself in my mind that day. Like today is an anxiety day. Okay. What do you need to do? Mm -hmm. I need to get up. I need to breathe. I need to hydrate. I need to do some kind of mindfulness practice, get out, move my body, be in nature and uh, snap myself out of it. So it really can be very, very simple. And we have a lot of those tools at the big silence. Dot com. Dot com. Thanks Karina. That was great.